welcome this is the energy vibration lazing for the sun moon and rising virgos it is the dear to wake from july 2017 and we'll begin the wake with the energy vibration of justice so this week it's going to be a hair week um at the zodiac energy of justice but yet still um, um your focus is going to be in a strength in a strength okay so this is a fire energy so you need to find the inner power in this week for you virgos okay um the zodiac energies is water from monday until saturday and the zodiac energy change and sunday to a fire energy which is going to be positive good news is coming from the the um, energy of the ten of ones. Um, the energy of the tens of ones is that your burden is going to finally come to an end, uh, and uh, you know a lot of information are going to be coming to you. So whatsoever that is playing out here um, for you, Virgos, in this week, uh, good news. Your week is going to begin with good news. Your number is going to be number eighty-eight. So this is good. This is positive. You Virgos are going to be working with a lot of people. I see the Queen of Wands. I see the King of Wands. I see. Um, a happy family life um, on Monday whatever is happening I see the seven of cups and message coming towards you or your dreams and wishes are going to be fulfilled I see the energy of the Emperor the energy of the Emperor is an organization and you're walking away from this organization so whoever you are out there if you need to walk away you need to find an inner strength to walk away from the organization find the inner strength walk away from the organization because the energy of the Sun is going to come and bring you positive energy because obviously this organization that you have been connected with was not giving you that positive energy that you was supposed to have and this organization this is as if you connect with somewhere to help you to do something and they weren't doing it they were working on a, a ego basis thing and this the universal angels come in and give you the push to you know say I'm ending this whatever this so together working together is I'm ending it because what you're doing is you know this energy that you're giving off you had you have to find the inner strength whoever you are out there is it your work that you find that you're not getting fulfillment go look for another work is it organizations or if you had a, you know whatever the situation is that you connect with someone for help or a group of people for help and that is not happening because they're working from out their ego base let them go let them go because when you let them go a positive energy is going to come in and connect to you because these people you know um and you know it's so surprising that I realize that you will go to people for help from an organization or group of people and they start to take on your thing and start to work with such an ego based energy that you wonder why are they um, working in an organization why that why are you running a business like that when you yourself isn't honest so that is what is going to come up here your week has been crowned by the seven of cups so a lot of people is going to be in this dreamy mood because you're dreaming of this and you're dreaming of that messages are going to come in to you um, and you know um, you you know whatever it is walk away from this organization because new love or whatever um, is coming in new love there is someone of a fire sign um, a young energy that is going to bring in new love you're going to connect with this person it's going to be extremely wonderful okay I'm gonna look at your week on Monday you have the ten of cups congratulations you guys your family connection with family or connection with your people at your work or connection with people at school whoever you're connected with and feel as a family and feel a connection it's going to be good and it's going to be good news so if you're trying to get in this um, colleges study wherever organization work uh, late at night whatever it is good news is coming in for you guys so whatever you were expecting whatever news to connect with group of people it's going to happen for you people so whatever um, situation that you wanted to connect with it's going to happen and it's going to be good 
Um, love is going to be a focus in this week for you um, Virgo people and on Tuesday um, new love is coming in some of you your lives and this new love is can be a connection from other people but it can be the universal angels bringing in um, uh, information and this is coming from someone of a young energy vibration someone 18 or 35 and um, if you women are looking for love it's gonna happen on Tuesday as we move on and we're looking at energy vibration um, you're governed towards the seven of cups so a lot of you are in this dream state and who are in love is just so in love in this dream state and it has to do you 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 um, you Virgo people it's, it's you're connecting with fire people but they're like the 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 five people are the Leos and the Sagittarius who you're connecting with because they're bringing a message of love but yet still these message of love you're feeling so in love all of you so you know it's it's good if you have a relationship with a, um, a Sagittarius or a Sagittarius or a Leo it's gonna be wonderful it's, it's, it's gonna be wonderful on the Thursday, you have a situation with the organization which you're going to just leave and walk away from these people and this organization. You're going to find the inner strength to do it. And you're going to see that after walking away from this organization and these group of people, you're going to realize that, you know, I've, I've done the best thing. You know, you're going to see. Because it's as if you realize that they weren't, they're working from out their ego base and you're saying goodbye. I don't need this in my life and I'm moving away from you people. I want to bring in positive energy in my life. I want to, you know, I don't need to be in the sort of a negative atmosphere that you're bringing on me because I don't need this in my life. So this is good. And you're just moving away, walking away from this organization. On Friday, you have the, the situation with the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands could be a family member or the Queen of Wands could be someone who you're connecting with, with uh, at your work. But whatever the situation is, the Queen of Wands has the energy. It, it, has, it has to do with money. So the Queen of Wands, it could be your, your mom or your sister or it could be a partner who you know um, you're having a monetary situation with and you're trying to bring balance to yourself but yet still um, you know you have to like share with her or she's asking you for help or that sort of a thing so whatever the situation is if you can help her help her because it's good because if you help her because what is so happening to you guys but I've finished this I've finished the days of the week on Friday the queen of ones is really a nice person you know and you know if you help her she's gonna help you back in return and you know the universe is going to bless you so help her whoever it is as we move forward we have the king of ones in reverse and it's as if the universal angels comes in because I princess energy is it's as if your spirit world hit this man out of your way whoever your spirit guides are for a lot of people they have moved this man out of your way it's as if you were yesterday move on because you're not a positive person because you're working on your ego base because you have been lying and making mischief and creating um, 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 chaos and the universe is as if your spirit guides because this is a very powerful spirit guide that came in and move it away because it could be for some people the, the karma the Lord of Karma and let me see who is that lady the Lord of Karma comes in and she is moving away this man because this man is a liar you know this is an Aries person and this man has created so much karmatic situation and you know they're moving it it's like it's, uh, the universe comes in because this you are an earth sign person and the universe come in and said you know and the lord of karma is is pal pal me pal pal p-a-l-l -L, so she is the lord of karma 
and she's coming in the Lord of Karma is coming in to move this man and and she's like standing up and boom out you know it's as if she see all this what he has done and boom out you know so this is good on Saturday finally on Sunday you have the ten of ones an end to a burden and this is good and the end to a burden is this is really the end to a burden and good news is coming to you you have good news coming to you because it's the end of a burden and whoever this man was this Aries man I'm getting Aries people I'm getting Aries it can be a Leo but I'm getting Aries whoever this Aries man was is being removed out of your life because whatever the karmatic and because this was a karmatic situation you have with this man because he has been coming up he has been touching a whole lot of you earth sign it's out it's done it's over um, you're moving on because it's a week of inner strength yet still some of you have, are looking for inner strength in this week and some of you or having the energy of a dreamy energy and these are the people who are in love because a lot of you Virgos are in love in this week a lot of you Virgos um first half of the week the energy of love comes in and this is a universal love because as if you look at this this is your own energy vibration in the first half of the week most of you are in love whatever it is most of you are in love message about love is coming in people are loving you and you are of the focus the main focus of what is happening and with that you have the ten of cups and with the ten of cups you have whoever this man is in the reverse so you're leaving this man behind bye and you're moving on to something that is so positive in your life because you are here you are here you are standing in your own energy vibration reading on Tuesday and you are here and it is the energy of uh, the ace of cups but this is you the water bearer um, is coming in because you and the Aquarius has the energy of the water bearer but you know the ten of cups is a positive family life a positive family situation and this is good good news is coming in there's going to be a really connection with your family okay looking at your second half of the week you have to deal with an organization and this organization it's there's finally an end coming to it whatever it was you're getting a message and finally an end coming to it and what is whatever is happening is that whoever this queen of pentacles is going to help you to bring your financial um, situation in stable you are going to some people will help her and she will help some people to bring this financial stability because whatever this organization and these people were doing they were working at a lower energy vibration and somehow she has changed something for you because sometimes people you're not aware but sometimes you know like you have a girlfriend or you have a family member and they go somewhere with you or do something with you and all of a sudden you 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 really see something and then they they just change just by being there to just change something change something and here it is so some of you will be working together with the Queen of Pentacles to bring balance to their financial situation or you yourself will be helping them to bring balance to their financial situation but whatever it is it's going to be good because by you helping this fire sign person this woman and it's it's a female energy so it's a woman by help it can be a Sagittarius it can be a Leo or a Aries woman you the universe is like gonna bless you okay so whatever vice versa because maybe you have such a good connection with this person and you were um, like from a, a soul family connection and she's gonna help you whatever you do or she do does for you it's, it, it's as if the energy of the star your wishes and dreams are going to come true because at the beginning of the week you have the ten of cups and you end in the week with a fire sign but yet still she's working on a good energy vibration something about money and balance it and she's bringing financial balance or you're bringing financial balance to her so this is good when we look at love oh my god you guys are so in love in this week it, it's unbelievable if you're if you're looking for someone if, if they're if you're looking for new love Tuesday is going to be the day 
especially for the women and for the men um, Wednesday is going to be your love day but Monday whatever is happening love is so powerful you guys are so connecting with your families if it's not your family it's people who are um, you're connecting with and you know Thursday whatever is happening you're leaving a, a situation or organization behind but yet still so much love is around you so for the people who are looking for love love is out there you are going to find love in this week it's a positive positive week that is full with love it's a week that your spirit guides are going to be connecting with you and moving out certain people so if you realize that your relationship just come to an end with a fire sign person uh, Aries person it is is supposed to happen okay so whatever it is the Lord of Karma is here in this week and she decided to just remove this person out of your life so you can focus on what is supposed to happen and you know we're never ever at the wrong place we are at the right place at the right time and this is what is happening so for love it's going to be just extremely powerful when we look at business what is happening here for business it's more a week where you're connecting with yourself your love is the most the it's a week where love is the most positive things so whatever burden some things whatever burden that you were carrying whatever burden that was happening you or it's ending it's ending on Sunday it's ending new message message will be coming out at the end of the week you will see it because the fire sign comes in so the fire sign is going to help you to remove whatsoever that was blocking you and especially this uh, energy of this Aries that was blocking you it's it's just gonna move this person out of your life whatever it is so it can be in a personal situation it's not something of that it's not dead it's just that whatever energy vibration is as if there was a karmatic situation this person keep on going 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 and the universe the Lord of Karma she comes in and she said no nope, no more you're out Boop, you're out so whenever this sort of a situation happen is whenever the universe see that someone is going too far with something and they come in and they step in because once you say I'm asking universal angels and guides to step in and deal with a situation for me that is what happened and your earth sign people so your answers your everybody answers you to help you with a situation we're working with the conscious spirits and let's see what we have for you Virgos wonderful at day ends rest so you need to rest at the day ends you need to rest and it says I find peace in nature and rest my body mind in order to connect to spirit it is so and it will be never forget I find peace in nature and rest my body mind in order to connect with spirit I find my peace in nature and rest my body and mind in order to connect with spirit and this is wonderful this is a beautiful card so for the people who um, connect with the fairies and that sort of a thing for the people who connect with the um, um, the angelical um, thing you know the the nature and that sort of a thing it's going to be just just so powerfully wonderful so it's going to be wonderful we are working with the oracles this week is the week the week of the oracles so let's see what the wisdom of the oracles have to say for you Virgos ah uh, no place like home this 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 is extremely wonderful I'm sorry I'm so in love with these cards because the wisdom of the oracles I see it as my grandmother <laughs> I call it my grandmother card I always say okay grandma what you want to um, say to me and this is so positive this is such a positive energy this is a wonderful energy this is a situation that when it says no place like home it's a positive energy because what it is saying is come back to who you are you know find that place that makes you home you know there's some people who travel the world but they yet still they always come back home and home is the place that you feel your energy and this is wonderful so it's a no place like home and it's said alternativeness alternative city of who you are at home yourself feeling at home 
um, arriving at a place where you just fit in and being comfortable in your own skin home feels safe and secure it's comfortable place to rest and create a place that is known and you can call your own the card signifies that your angels and guides um, ability to trust yourself and feel at home in your own skin is being to solve as a claim your dignity and integrity aspect of yourself no one can take away from you what you have so remember it doesn't really matter so whoever that man was lying and cheating and deceiving and that organization that was trying to take away something from you it's not going to happen you know who you are you hold your head up I yet with neither pride or humanity instead you stand as the observer seen through the eyes of your soul this puts you in a position of power and strength alternatively is your own you are safe here and in your house of your spirit you will be always so this is wonderful wonderful positive positive wonderful energies and a positive energies for you Tauruses to leave you with and this is going to be wonderful so i'm saying to you guys have a wonderful time please remember to thumbs up and i talk to you next week namaste